Hello and welcome back. I'm Faintly Saintly and this is Taskmaster VR. If you've been following along, we've covered episode one and episode two in the last two videos, and now it's time for episode three. Had some mixed results in episode two. One I'd definitely like to try again is this uh, pipe one where we have to get the egg to travel the longest distance. I think I can definitely do better there. Um, but anyway, we'll move on. And again, if you like this content and want to see more of it, please consider subscribing. Then you'll be informed when the next few episodes drop. And I do cover lots of other games as well, so stick around. Let's get on with it. Make your way into the studio and we'll meet you there. Hello and welcome to Taskmaster. Before you, a collection of tasks to be completed, and me, Greg Davis, a giant enigmatic man whose sole reason for existing is to watch your pathetic attempts and openly mock you for trying. Very to my true. left is a man whose face resembles a child's drawing of some old ham. It's little Alex Horn. Thank you, Greg, for that. Are you ready for the banter section? No, am I ever? Well, what do you want to talk about? I want to talk about absolutely nothing. Let's immediately move on to the first task instead and skip your bit, because doing that means you get paid less. Oh, right. Oh. Why haven't I got to oh, know the task yet? Bit. Alex! And now a task in which we ask you to insert small objects into an animal. Oh, that sounds good. <laughs> Here we go, what have we got today? What is that? A paper mache dinosaur? Anything neglectful parent. Hello. Please do not touch the pinata until instructed. It's pinata. Okay. Mm, any hints? I wonder what all this is about. Uh, we'll just get stuck into it, I think. Pick ten items from around the house and fill the pinata. Very large items will not fit. There is a secret rule. You have 10 minutes. Your time starts now. I've started the timer. You may begin stuffing the pinata. What's the secret rule? Ten items from around the house and fill the pinata. Secret rule. I have to like walk them through this or something or go in and out a certain door. It does specify from the house, right? So maybe I'll stick to this and I won't get anything from the yard or the shed. In task we trust. That's a little item. Oh, there's lots of different colored pineapples. Maybe they all have to be the same. Do I have to walk them all through under these maybe? And how do I? No, sorry. Miss, let's try again. What do you, what do you mean? Uh oh. There's a secret rule. Is there a hint somewhere? In the kitchen. Ducks. Maybe they're all ducks. Um, anything in the lab? More ducks? Cheeky texts by Mark Watson, that's a good reference. Um, That's the box that had the duck in it. That was in one of the tasks on the TV show. There must be ducks, right? Surely. 
Going with the duck theory. Where's my other duck? And I'll run them through the banners because these are new. Are they just a distraction? I don't know. How do you like this, Alex? No, incorrect. Do I have to? God damn. <laughs> oh, what else could it be? Are they bricks? Lots of bricks. No good, sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna lose it. What else could it be? Likeness of the taskmaster. Um might be too big. Food? Lobsters. Can't grab any of these. Shoes. Balls. Grab the cricket ball and a tennis ball. I'll stick to my little superstitious movement over here through the banners. Maybe I have to throw them from off the stage. Oh dear, that will be a miss. Yes. Oh, oh. A tennis ball from off the stage. Tennis ball off the stage. Tennis ball off the stage. Um, 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 um. Maybe golf ball will do. Oh, the cricket ball was a no, wasn't it? We'll see. I will do this run around again. One out of ten is not looking good. Five minutes. Five minutes remaining. Yes, that's allowed. Oh. Yes. Okay. All right. Like, is is one of these balls going to be allowed? I won't do the run this time. I'll stand off the stage. Okay, so I need a golf ball or a tennis ball. Or was it to do with my aim? Because that one didn't go in the slot. I just don't know. A potato. Sort of doesn't fit with the rules though, does it? Four minutes. Any more balls in the shed or the garage? So the golf ball was allowed. A really shiny book. Break all the eggs. I'll grab an apple. Oh, a bowl of apples. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna run out here. Maybe the front door was the key. It's really hard to say. Run through all those. Stand off the stage. Oh, I've only got one left anyway. <laughs> and I've missed it. No, I didn't. Some in there for you and seal it up. You can take a break while we set up part two of the task. Ooh. Oh, what a twist! This is for you. Okay. Smash all the pinatas. The task will end if you break your own pinata. You have two minutes. Your time starts now. 
smash all the pinatas, it will end if I break my own. And mine was green, so. Very good for getting the aggression out this task. I tested it 458 times. <laughs> sure you did, Alex. All right, so I'm just gonna start with all the non-green ones. This is um, <laughs> quite cathartic, actually. Where's my stick? Doesn't matter, I can just punch him. <gasps> oh, that wasn't mine. That wasn't mine either, actually. I was more dinosaur than llama. So that means... You weren't mine. Which one was it? I feel like I don't remember the eye. But that pattern doesn't look familiar. I'm gonna smash this one. Yes. Okay. What was the secret rule? After all that. <laughs> I'm very confused. This could go either way. I enjoyed this task immensely because it incorporated my main motivator in life. The violent destruction of cutesy nonsense. So, first things first. Did they stuff and plug their pinata correctly? No, I'm afraid not. I had to complete it for them. Off to a rum start. One point docked, I'm afraid. So, on to oh, the exciting... That dialogue had more text he didn't say. I didn't catch what it said, though. At one point, it looked like you were trying to smash a pinata open with your bare hands. I was. Trying to look all tough, but coming off like an adorable kitten pouring at a ball of wool. They kept their pinata safe, right? Bosh! Job done? Yes, they did. And they broke lots of wrong ones too, which either means they have excellent visual recall or excellent luck. Visual That's recall, that one. Know, but the results speak for themselves. Let's move on. Well, yes. Let's move on to the final scores, I think. A few pinatas left alive, but a strong message sent, certainly. Only one, wasn't there? Points. Okay. All right, I'll take it. Don't mean to argue. Right, Alex. Hurry up and give me another task before I give you a big kick. Yes, right. Next up, we're getting absolutely legless. <laughs> Hello. Please pick up the task card, take your time reading it, then drop it when you're ready to start the task. Okay, what have we got here? Why are my hands inside each other? A little picnic. A tray of eggs. A grabber. Okay. Hold on to the table edge to begin. That one, I assume. Leave the lab with the eggs still on the table and unbroken. You may not handle the eggs. Your time starts when the leg is removed. Hold on to the table edge to begin. Leave the lab with the egg still on the table and unbroken. Okay, now hold on to the edge of the hinged table. Once you've done that, I'm going to take the table leg away and you'll be the table's only support. Can I have this? Oh dear. Um, is it cheating to find something else to put <laughs> under the table? Uh, it won't let me. That would be a nice support. Anyway. Here we go. I'm going to hold on to it left-handed. Perfect. Removing the leg. Now. Oh. I have successfully withdrawn the leg. Your well done. Started. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Was that supposed to happen? Try to get the eggs off the floor. Okay. Oh dear. Oh dear, indeed, Alex. Ah. Stay. Hmm. 
Oh, no, 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 no. Mm, I think the table might not be quite level. Do you reckon? Uh, <laughs> um... Once used to get a floppy disk off a skeleton. Well, this has turned into a right disaster. Okay, we still have some eggs. What was the actual task? I'll leave the lab with the eggs still on the table and unbroken. One is better than none, right? Bye, Alex. <laughs> that was a disaster from the start. Let's just get straight into this one, I think. Yes, Can let's. I just say, someone who's a big fan of eggs, I'm genuinely angry about how things went down. <laughs> I definitely I'm sorry. detected the unmistakable sound of egg on the floor there. Yes, I'm afraid to say, not all eggs survived that one. Oh, very sad. A waste of a perfectly enticing breakfast. I apologise. The litter pickers was a good call, I thought. Smart thinking. Yes, the litter pickers were used to solid effect. Thank you. Of course they were. Who can resist a cheeky pinch on the litter picker? Park keepers, probably. Bit of a busman's holiday for a park keeper is a litter picker. Shall we move on to the scores, then? <laughs> I think we'd better. I mean, they weren't all smashed, I guess, so that counts for something. That's right. One point. Oh, no. <laughs> Come on. Oh, no, that's fair. That's fair. All right. Time for the studio task. Please make your way to the stage. Pinata's back. Have we learned a little lesson? An intriguing yes. setup. It looks like an art installation. Yes, Everything it does. Everything we do in the studio is technically art. In that case, my bottom is one of the most prolific artists of all time because I've been sitting here trumping constantly all day. Right, come on, Warhol. Let's get things moving. Okay. Use the items in the pinata to knock the skittle off the plinth from as far away as possible. One throw per item. You have two minutes. Your time starts when Alex blows his whistle. From as far away as possible. So it's not going to get much further than this, is it? Well, that's interesting. Then come back and roll. Knock the skittle off the plinth. So only the items in the pinata can be used. I've provided you with a nice big bat to whack the pinata with. Then Thank you. it's just a case of using only the items inside to knock the skittle off the plinth. All clear? Ready? Clear. What did you give me, Alex? Oh, no. My, no. Come back. Well, that's wonderful. Truly. Okay. Say I've lost half my items to start. That's really good. What? Did I get too close then? If my hand crosses this line. <laughs> okay, all right. Whoa. I see. Okay, we've got one golf ball. Let's survive the uh, pinata explosion. <laughs> Sixty seconds and counting. This is. You gave me a spoon. 
Oh, that... Mm. Are you serious? That's all your items used up. Bring yourself back down here and we'll take a look at what that's done for the final score. Oh, it's done nothing. I can't believe... Mm. <laughs> Exact pinata from the earlier task with all of the same items in it, presumably tittering the whole time. You pleased with yourself? Yes, immensely. Well, it seems you fell into Alex's little trap by picking items that are good for filling pinatas but bad for filling skittles. Yeah, How are right. your smugness levels, Alex? Off the chain. <laughs> so, what's the score? Dear, oh dear, just a perfect storm of incompetence the whole way through. The skittle remains standing. Zero points. It's a new low. My short-term memory and rudimentary math skills are completely shot these days. So, Alex, where are we with the episode score? It's the equivalent of a single task performed competently. Five points. I was just thinking. So what have we learned today? We've learned that in the modern world, prudence and a fine eye for detail are critical attributes. And you may be asked at any moment to smash open a small donkey whose guts are nothing but gravy and glitter. Thank you for playing, and goodbye. Right, so what did we learn? Taskmaster is a fickle beast. <laughs> uh, did it right at the start. Had no idea what was going on with that secret rule, but, you know, got a few points for it not knowing that that would come back and buy me on this last task in which I got nothing. And of course, all the eggy disaster in the second task, which basically, as Alex put it, I had one competent task worth of points in this episode. Uh, needless to say, I will be coming back to replay that. You can replay individual tasks here to improve your score uh, because I'm a proud person and this will not stand. However, I think you play the series in one go. So I can't undo it this time. Um, but in another playthrough, I can work to uh, improve my episode score. So I want to leave it there. Thank you for watching. If you like this and want to see more, please consider subscribing. Obviously, we've got two more episodes to cover, and I will do those in the next two videos. I also cover other VR games and indie games as well, so stick around for that. And if you have any game suggestions you'd like me to cover, please let me know in the comments down below. Thank you, and I'll see you next time.